Na prídi. I hope that you can see the police in action. In one of the previous videos I have shown you that you know the tourists oh we are complete but tourists are just you know running over on the other side of the road even though you know it's quite congested for Saturday afternoon well 11 30 and you wouldn't believe it while those two the police patrol was you know is dealing with that guy three more before I started recording not even 15 meters away ran all across the street no. and police of course didn't do anything but don't tell me it's a stroller he's crossing the street with a stroller let's try to zoom hopefully we will get better uh, we will see it better when we will near we will be more closer so and I wanted to continue also regarding the healthcare system another problem that is um, that basically started uh, you know well it started escalated during the COVID was that because you know people couldn't get to their primary care physicians they started to go for basically minor non-urgent medical conditions to the ER to ER several ERs and that also put additional strength strain on not the primary system but you know secondary and tertiary 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 secondary and that means you know additional um, and of course um, a lot of these uh, visits were unnecessary you know people with just a sniffle went to the store uh, to the ER so yeah I hope that he will have to pay a lot and now he's arguing that he, he couldn't walk that he can't walk to there you know or there fucking idiot and yesterday um, in the evening when I was leaving uh, to go to the city center they were stopping here people at the same point well basically the same area and it was foggy it was very bad fog you know you couldn't see 50 meters and people were running across the road So yeah, uh, you know, back to the healthcare, you know, and with, um, you know, ERs and primary physicians, primary care physicians being bombarded uh, with uh, first genuine uh, patients, you know, due to COVID and of course other conditions and then you had people with minor conditions or non-urgent conditions 
it was just, you know, taking up all the resources. And yeah, this is also one of the reasons, you know, you know, and that of course led to, you know, burnout of the doctors. Okay, number two. Police made them, made him walk to the to the correct point where he can get on the other side of the road. Lizzie, Riva, no pretty. Oh yeah. And he has red, it's green and he is crossing the road. Complete idiot. Eh? You cannot believe this. And there is a pol another police patrol. And then, you know, someone will hit him and his kid and everyone else would be at fault. And uh, okay, once again trying to go back to the topic of Chakamo Lizi, Rdecha Mamo. Back to the topic of healthcare. Another problem is also that currently um, we are experiencing also, well, this demographic shift has been going on for several years now, even decades. You know, um, several decades now we have, you know, um, number of births are, newborns are, you know, dropping. And now we have the, let's say, large post-war generations are, going into you know retirement this also affects you know some kid is Pridna, pridna, greva, tukaj, tukaj, tukaj greva, glej, greva v krok. Tukaj. Neči, eko. Yeah. Interestingly, she is handling larger banks, but this small, she is not so. Pet, tukaj greva, eko. Zdaj šel stran. Not to mention uh, regarding, you know, uh, the healthcare system, healthcare problems is also, you know, the number of, let's say, Slovenes is dropping, but we are experiencing also uh, increasing, you know, migration immigration or also well in both in both let's say directions a lot of slovenian doctors are going you know in other countries where they can earn more more you know especially in austria germany pretty greva lizzy no pet while at the same time you know we have influx of um, people that are trying you know well, temporary or permanent residency they are trying to acquire residency here in Slovenia or move out to here you know in the hopes of gaining citizenship which of course brings you know Lisa 
more patients, potential patients. Gleba, eko, je nehal pokat, pridna. You know, you have to take into the consideration all of these facts when you are planning or dealing with the, you know, healthcare system, especially when it's run by local community. So, yeah. Okay, let's end on this point. I think that I have covered the healthcare system pretty thoroughly. I don't thorough, thorough, thoroughly. Most likely I have missed something, but yeah, let's end on this point.